So, YouTube, I built a new robot today, and I just wanted to show you because I think it's pretty cool. Uh, I made it out of a Vexplorer from Vex, Vexplorer kit, and it looks, can't really tell what it is from right here, but as I turn this around, you can see there's a video camera on the front. So basically what this robot does is it goes around and takes videos for you. Um, you can also plug it into your computer um, via these special wires and adapters that I have and you can view what the robot is viewing from the camera on your computer screen. So uh, let me turn it on. One second. Put it down on the floor. And uh, after I show you this, I'll bring it downstairs and put it next to my computer. So, we have two basic functions. We have right wheel forward, left wheel forward, both, backward, forward, backward, basic stuff. cool thing is, using an extra remote right here, I can make this video camera move side to side. So I can pan the camera using that motor. So this is uh, useful for, of course, viewing um, on your computer screen. So uh, I thought this was just a pretty cool robot to show you guys. So let me bring it downstairs, and I'll be right back. So I have my robot here next to my computer. And before I show you um, the video on the computer monitor, I'm going to show you how I have this set up over here. So, first thing I have plugged into a USB port is a USB adapter. This allows my robot to go a little bit farther um, while it's hooked up to the computer. Then, hooked up to the USB adapter is a USB cable that goes from there to a device called the Dazzle. This uh, is a video capture card and allows you to hook your camera up to the computer as a webcam. From there, we have the cable that came with the camera that you're supposed to hook up to the TV, but instead we're hooking up to here. The uh, Dazzle has a S video port, A video port, uh, audio, and another audio, I think. So I don't, I'm not for I'm not sure. So from there, we would plug this jack into the camera. So, just a minute, I'll show you guys. Now that we've hooked the cables up to the computer, we're going to bring up Windows Movie Maker or any other program that's able to capture video from a direct device. So I'm going to go ahead and click Capture from Video Device. Now the, the program has recognized, it says Dazzle DVC 100 Video Device. So it recognizes that uh, Dazzle device. So we're going to go ahead and click that and next. Also, um, <coughs> excuse me, um, if you want audio in your video on the computer, you're going to have to hook up a microphone to your computer port because the Dazzle does not support audio. So just let you guys know. So, before I go ahead and capture the video, I'm going to plug this cable into the back of the webcam, the video camera. So, it's now plugged in right there. I'm going to turn it on. And I'm going to turn the remote on. 
So I'm going to name this file Vex Robocam. So let's Let's see. Oh, so we have to turn the camera on now. And now that it's on, you should see right there. It's a little bit dark. I'm going to see if I can turn the lights up in here. I don't have the best camera hooked up. So, not the best lighting, but you can see it showed up there. And if I take the remote, you can see that the camera is capturing everything that's happening from the robot. So I'm going to go ahead and try the panning feature. And that works pretty good. So you guys get it. This works really good. It's not the most useful robot, but I think it's pretty cool. And if you guys have a wireless webcam, you could try that with this too. So, that's my Vex Robocam.